Hello fellow couch potatoes, welcome to today's video. We are looking into the 30 men from a Michelle Young Seasons. Let's get into it. Let's get to know the cast of the Bachelorette Michelle Young Season. Starting off with the Bachelorette herself, Michelle Young. After joining Matt James season as a late arrival, Michelle immediately stole the bachelor's attention along with the hearts of millions who fell in love with her captivating smile and charming sense of humor. A former Division I basketball player from Minnesota, the 20-year-old kindergarten teacher now focuses on preparing her students to be the next generation of community leaders. Michelle has big dreams for the future and she says she wants a man by her side that is supportive and driven to make the world a better place. She is looking for the superman to her superwoman and is ready to find love with whom she can start a family of her own. Now let's meet the man. Alec Thompson is 29 and is an engineer from North Carlston. Alec lives to make the most out of every day. After his first marriage ended, Alec learned a lot about the value of commitment and what it takes to truly make love last. So he's not here to waste anyone's time. He is dependable, emotionally intelligent and values integrity above all else. Alec is hoping to find a woman who appreciates how much his career means to him but will also make him want to be sentimental and bring out the fun side out of him. He is a true believer in the old school, head over heels, unconditional type of love and is ready to find that with the beautiful Michelle. Alec is also a former football player turned engineer. He loves to read GQ magazine. And Alec does not think bowling makes for a romantic date night, but his favorite thing to eat for breakfast is cottage cheese. Up next, we have one of two Brandons, Brandon J, who is 26 years old and is a traveling nurse recruiter from Portland. Brandon J may be young, but he knows exactly what he wants in life and is very serious about finding the one with whom to settle down. He is kind, confident, and looking for a wife whose passionate personality can keep up with his. Brandon J wants someone who has goals and the focus to achieve them. He doesn't want to be with someone who is still figuring herself out. He hopes to find someone who can be his best friend and teammate for the rest of their lives. Speaking of teammates, not only is Brandon J looking for love, but he's also looking for a little basketball. He is a self-proclaimed basketball fiend, and when given the opportunity, he doesn't plan on missing out on his shot with Michelle. Brandon J once hopped on stage during a Lil Wayne and Drake concert. He loves the fresh Prince of Belay, and Brandon has no interest in ever going bungee jumping. That last one is for the producers. Brandon number two, Brandon Kiefer, is 29 years old and is a brand manager who lives in Austin, Texas. Brandon K is a polished southern gentleman who just hasn't found the right one yet. He is looking for love that is playful and feisty and says that his dream woman will be able to make even the most mundane of moments special. For Brandon K, love should be simple but memorable. His ideal connection is effortless with an obvious chemistry but also fun and affectionate. He wants to make a real social impact within his community and hopes to find a partner who wants to make the world a better place alongside him. Brandon K says he'll know he's found the one when being together makes him want the night to never end so he's hoping to many sunrises together for him and Michelle. Brandon K loves the cha-cha slides dreams of delivering someone an oversized check for a life-changing amount of money and he always 
buys travel insurance. Next up, we have a Brian Witterman, who is 31 years old. He is an NFL player for Chicago. Brian is not your stereotypical jock. He's a foodie, religious, family oriented completely down to earth and all about finding himself a wife. He considers himself to be quite the romantic and thanks to all the rom-coms his older sister made him watch growing up, Brian is all about making big moves to show his affection. He loves to travel and hopes to find a partner who will join him as he dines his way out across the globe. Brian is a big believer in fate and feels that him being here to meet Michelle is serendipitous and that is a match truly meant to be. Brian loves physiology and would love to ask Socrates a few questions. Brian also has been to every continent except Antarctica and he thinks orchards are majestic. Next we have Casey Woods. Casey Woods is 36 years old, advertising creative director and lives in Miami Beach, Florida. Casey is at a point in his life where he wants something serious and long lasting. Though he loves life in Miami, he says he has outgrown the local dating scene where women care more about their Instagram stories than making meaningful connections. He is looking for a woman who is ready to be a mom because Casey is looking to start a family and give his mom all of the grandbabies she so badly craves. Casey also loves his job raising money for philanthropic ventures and hopes to find a wife who gets as much satisfaction in helping others as he does. Casey is excited to meet Michelle and focus on finding love with out all the outside world distractions. He is all about the love and we can't wait to see what this journey has in store for him and the bachelorette. Casey says he is secretly a hippie, likes camping, but he hates sleeping in tents and he takes his eggs scrambled with salsa. Up next, we have Christopher Garland, who is 28 years old and is a motivational speaker in Halifax. For Chris G, commitment is the name of the game. As kind-hearted as you would expect any Canadian man to be, Chris G says he is looking for a genuine connection and for someone who is all in on him the way he is on her. His ideal woman is attractive, vulnerable, and a good person on the inside. Chris is looking for his best friend, someone who he can bring home to his family and someone who he absolutely adores. When he says he's looking for love, he is looking for the right soul and for someone his energy bonds to. Will there be that instant spark when Chris meets Michelle? We'll have to find out. We know that Chris G loves escape rooms he enjoys performing spoken word poetry and he has two cats one named cat and one named small cat so creative the other chris is chris sutton who is 28 years old and a commodities broker in west hollywood california this southern gentleman turned california beach boy is ready to find love. His friends describe him as goofy and easygoing, but when it comes to relationships, he isn't here to joke around. When Chris S falls, he falls hard. He is looking for an adventurous woman who is confident, kind, and selfless. He does not have a specific type and prides himself in falling in love with someone on the inside rather than the outside. In five years, Chris S hopes to be married with kids and making a positive impact on the world. He is a firm believer that chivalry isn't dead and when the time comes, he is ready to sweep Michelle off her feet. Chris S gives a mean blue steel face and he loves to travel, but burnt Pizza makes Chris is mad. Clayton Etchard is 28 years old. He's a medical sales rep and he's from Colombia. 
Clayton is a Missouri thoroughbred who has it all good looks, great job, and a wonderful family. The only thing missing is the perfect woman with whom to share his life. His dream woman is funny, independent, intelligent, and athletic enough to join him at the gym for a workout. He wants to find something truly special and is willing to put in the hard work to find love that will last forever. Clayton is so excited to meet Michelle and loves that she has a passion for her career. His mom is a teacher just like Michelle and he finds it impressive that she's made this journey work without having to take time away from her students. Clayton truly believes that Michelle could be the perfect match for him. Will they hit it off? Clayton had a mohawk in college. His rapping alter ego name is Clay Duh. And Clayton would love to own multiple gyms. Daniel truly is 26, a firefighter from Austin, Texas. Um, Daniel brings the heat in all aspects of his life. He is living out his childhood dream of being a firefighter and spends his free time playing sports, swimming, hiking, and biking. His favorite thing in the world is being an uncle to his four nieces, and now he's ready to settle down and have a family of his own. Daniel's perfect woman is adventurous, fun, intelligent, and above all, kind. He values good energy, great conversation, and loves a woman who constantly keeps him on his toes. Daniel loves that Michelle seems to have that same competitive spirit that he does, and with everything that he knows about her so far, he's optimistic he won't be going home a single man. Daniel really wants to know if aliens exist and he is a connect for champ and he loves Christmas music. Oh, it's so sweet. Edward Narajo, who is 27 years old, a wellness coach from Los Angeles, California. Edward is outgoing, optimistic and a self-proclaimed amazing wingman but now it's time to focus on finding happiness for himself. Red flag. He spends most of his weekends exploring new places and needs a woman who isn't afraid of a little adventure. She would be emotionally articulate and have a healthy appetite for learning and personal growth. She must love dogs because Edward's pup Willow is always by his side. Edward loves to express himself through words of affirmation and physical touch, so if Michelle is looking for someone who isn't going to hold back, she won't have to look any further. Edward dreams of visiting Disney World one day. He enjoys listening to John Mayer's music, especially on road trips, and is excited by a good obstacle course. Garrett Ada, who is 33, is a tech CEO at Salt Lake City. Garrett is not afraid of a little risk. He dropped out of college to start what has become an incredibly successful tech company and spends his free time traveling the world, skydiving, paragliding, and speed flying. He is always pushing himself to grow as a person and needs a woman who wants the same for herself. She should also be open-minded, authentic, and not afraid of a little salsa dancing. Garrett is hoping for a family one day, and if a woman does not want kids, then he is not interested. Garrett is serious about finding the one and is ready to have a little fun finding her. Garrett loves plants and calls himself a plant daddy. Growing up, Garrett had a bowl cut and he loves pickles. That's odd. Up next, we have Jack Russell, who is 30 years old, a former army officer from Philadelphia. Jack is a sweet and compassionate man who is ready to start the next chapter of his life. He is incredibly loyal, especially when it comes to his family, and he described himself as genuine and driven.
Jack is looking for a woman who is emotionally mature, compassionate, silly, and up for joining him on a challenging hike. While he tends to be on the shyer side, he is attracted to women who are outgoing, strong, and not afraid to push him outside his comfort zone. When Jack is excited about someone, he gets very motivated to do things that make her feel loved and appreciated. Luckily, Jack is very excited to meet Michelle, so we can't wait to see what he has planned for her. Jack will throw up at any sight of an onion and he is afraid of dancing, but he loves to play kickball. Jamie Scar is 32 years old, a biotech CEO from San Diego, California. Jamie is a catch. He is a world traveler with a taste for all things and is the type of guy who will show up at the airport and let the ticketing agent decide his destination. He actually did that and had an amazing week in Uruguay. He has a great job, is extremely smart, and has a healthy idea of exactly what he needs in a wife. Jamie is looking for someone to be his partner in this never-ending adventure called life. She should be independent, driven, always ready to head out for a dinner at the newest local spot. For Jamie, life is about valuing cultural experiences and making memories. So hopefully, Michelle is up for the ride. Jamie once traveled to Yukodo just to try their chocolate. He has never watched an episode of reality TV in his life. I call BS, but Jamie's favorite game is chess. Joe Coleman is 28 years old, a real estate developer from Minneapolis. Minneapolis? I am now from America. I don't know. Okay? Okay. Joe is a Minnesota born and raised city boy with a heart of gold. He played basketball at the University of Minnesota and while he says that basketball was his first true love, he's now ready to build a life outside of sports and find a wife. Joe, who describes himself as introverted, is looking for a woman who is smart, caring, articulate and able to make him love. He wants someone with aligning values and hopes they are ready for a family because Joe hopes to have at least three or four kids. Overall, Joe wants to find a real one with whom he can build something solid that will stand the test of time. Joe is scared of spiders, so am I. Joe loves snacks and wants to travel to the... Joe wants to travel to the Galapahu Islands one day. Jomari Gable is 26 years old, a personal trainer from Fresno. Jomari says he is a sucker for love. He falls hard and fast and says that a smile tells you everything you need to know about a person. He is a driven dental giant whose dream is to own a gym and have a woman by his side to grow old with and whom to enjoy life. His perfect woman is simple, athletic and goofy. Life is never boring when Jomari is around and he plans to make the most out of every second he has with Michelle. Jomari eats an entire watermelon every morning, like every every morning. The light of Jomari's life is his puppy buddy and Jomari would love to be a tour guide in Antarctica. Leroy Arthur is 27 years old. He's a biomedical PhD student in Dallas, Texas. Leroy is a true academic who has a flair for fashion and penchant for fun. He was born in Italy to parents who immigrated from Ghana and then moved with his family to the US in pursuit of the American dream. He has worked incredibly hard in his educational pursuits and now as that chapter of his life comes to a close, Leroy wants to find someone with whom he can share his beautiful world. 
he is incredibly proud of his strong Ghanaian roots and wants someone who will always support him being his most authentic self. Leroy loves brunch, but nothing makes him happier than holding hands with the woman he loves. He says that when he dates, he dates with intention. His intention here, hopefully, live hand in hand with the love of his life. Leroy loves go-karting and does not like to gamble. And he's a big fan of breakfast in bed. L.T. Murray the fourth is 38, a yoga guru from Bellevue. LT has, ne LT has never had to worry about much in his life. He is very much fulfilled professionally and in his family life, the only thing missing, someone to share his happiness with. LT says he doesn't have any real deal breakers and is more focused on finding a genuine connection in a partner. He wants to find someone who will appreciate his quirky sense of humor, join him on long walks and truly bring out the best in him. LT is a romantic at heart who at his core just wants to find someone with whom to watch old movies and exchange love letters. LT love his two pets, Savannah cats. He lives for a good spin class and has wanted to his grandfather's initials over his heart. I'm assuming he's also LT. Martin Gelspan is also a personal trainer who's 29 years old from Miami, Florida. At any given time, Martin can be found working out on a beach in Miami. A passionate and disciplined man, he spends his days perfecting his physique and spending time with loud fun family who immigrated from Argentina when he was 10 years old. Martin says he gets his passion from his parents and credits them for teaching him how a husband should treat his wife. Martin is looking for a mature, health-conscious woman who wants to be loved. He is ready to make a big commitment and plans to be fearless in his pursuit of love. Martin can do a backflip. He would love to get lost in a foreign country and can cook basics very well. Johnson is 36 years old, an academic administrator in San Diego, California. Molik is a hopeless romantic who is so ready to find his person. Raised by women all around him, he describes himself as a domesticated renaissance man who believes wholeheartedly in the power of love and family. He is looking for a woman of quality, someone with morals, who is selfless, patient and well-mannered. Molik has an eight-year-old son who is the best gift of love that he has ever received. From his son, he has learned what true unconditional love is and is ready to share that with the love of his life. Molik does not like frogs. He has his motorcycle license and his favorite author is Nicholas Sparks. Nate or Lukoya is 27 years old. He's a sales executive from Austin, Texas. When you walk in a room, it's hard not to notice Nate. He has a smile that sparkles like the stars. He is always the life of the party. And to boot, he's a 6 foot 8 inch Adonis, Adonis of a man. Nate doesn't have trouble meeting women, but as he edges closer to 30, he's more focused on finding a long-lasting relationship that will go the distance. His dream woman is outgoing, spontaneous, and has enough swagger of her own to keep up with him. He's looking for a connection filled with heat and for someone who will be just as passionate about him as he is about her. Nate is looking for a teammate for life and is confident that Michelle may just be the one he's been looking for. 
Nate dreams of visiting the Taj Mahal, can't dance to save his life and likes edible arrangements. Ulumide is 27, an IT analyst from Newark, New Jersey, NJ, not sure. A former D1 hooper at Rutgers University, Olumida knows how to compete at a high level and is coming here with one thing on his mind, Michelle. He thinks she is just absolutely beautiful and as a strong believer in fate, he says that his journey is destined to be. He is not only confident but is also caring, attentive and more than willing to go above and beyond for the woman he loves. Olumide is ready to find his wife and he is coming in hot. Olumide Onajide enjoys the theater. Favorite flower is a cherry blossom and hates tofu. Pardeep Singh, sing to the power of the Lord. Oh, sorry. Pardeep Singh is a 30-year-old neuroscientist from Brooklyn, New York. Pardeep is the perfect combo of looks and intelligence. For work, he studies the brain to find cures for diseases like Parkinson's and Alzheimer's. And though he spends his days buttoned up in a lab, when he has free time, he's anything but serious. This self-proclaimed nerd who loves comic con, video games, and reading also has an undeniable Brooklyn edge about him. Pardeep is truly a unique cat who wants to find someone family orientated, affectionate, and who cares about making the world a better place just as much as he does. And if she can occasionally nerd out with him, great. Pardeep loves to sleep in on Saturdays, he loves New Year's because he loves new beginnings, so he should love Mondays. Podib doesn't enjoy sitting on park benches. Peter Izzo is 26, a pizza preneur from Port St. John, FL, Florida. Peter is a hopeless romantic who commits for the long haul. He is a man of passion. And when he decided to professionally pursue his love of food, he moved all the way to Italy to study the cuisine firsthand. Now that he's fulfilled his childhood dream of opening up his own very successful pizzeri, pizzeria, pizzeru, pizzeriri, he's, I'm kidding, he's ready to find his person and build his culinary empire. Peter's dream woman is honest, committed, spontaneous, and not interested in taking politics on a date. She's ready to support her man, but also has ambitions of her own. She also must love food because as ready as Peter is to find a wife, part of his heart will always belong to his first love, Peter, I mean food. Peter loves deep house music. He doesn't like libraries and Peter loves red wine and calls himself a vino head or vino head. PJ Henderson is 30 years old and we have another firefighter and he is from Houston, Texas. PJ is a natural caretaker. He loves his job as a firefighter and is someone who wants to make sure that the people he loves are always happy, protected and healthy. He's very ready to get married and have a family of his own. But he just wants to make sure that when he does settle down, it's with the right woman. Nothing lights his fire more than a loyal woman with a drive and beauty. He loves when he and his partner can enjoy working out together and hopes to find someone who has a thirst for travel just as much as he does. PJ says that he is the last single man standing out of all his friends and he's ready to change that for good. PJ loves to pass time by working on a Rubik's Cube and he does not enjoy the opera but he wants to visit Brazil and attend carnival. 
Rick Lee is 32 years old, medical sales rep from Los Angeles, California. Rick is a self-proclaimed hopeless romantic who has been thinking about his future wife for as long as he can remember. He finds romanticism in the small things in life and is the type of guy who will send you flowers at work for no reason but to say I love you. He wears his heart on his sleeve because when he is into someone, he wants them to know and doesn't want to play games. He does love a good games night though because he says he can tell a lot about someone's personality when competition is involved. At the end of the day, Rick wants to find his heart's true counterpart and someone who can make the world a better place alongside him. Rick loves his dog, Nana. The movie Hitch taught Rick everything he needs to know about life and Rick is not a fan of double dates. While he needs to be a fan of group dates, is 29 years old, a sales rep from Ranko Kukamonga. Rodney is a glass half full kind of guy. After his dreams of playing in the NFL were shattered by a career ending injury, Rodney picked himself up and redirected his ambition. He has a great job he enjoys, but life would be better if there was someone he loved waiting for him at home every night. Rodney is looking for someone who is honest, active, and ideally a former student athlete like himself. He wants to find a deep mental connection with someone, but also wants a woman who can laugh with every day. Rodney knows exactly what he wants and he is looking for someone who has that clear vision too. He's done wasting time and is ready to be wifed up. Rodney is afraid of opossums, opsums, opa who? What is that? What is that? Google, what is an opossum? Rodney is terrified of being catfished. Rodney is very into intimate fasting, but only on weekends. Romeo Alexander is a 32-year-old mathematician from New York City, New York. For Romeo, math has always come easy. The one equation has yet to be solved though is Romeo plus X equals true love. And this Harvard graduate is here to find that missing variable. He is looking for an adventurous woman who is smart, active, and motivated. Nothing turns him on more than someone with a curious mind. In a dream world, Romeo would love to find a woman who will spend the day exploring New York's many museums and once the sun goes down, will tear up the dance floor with him at salsa night. Like his famous namesake, Romeo is a passionate man and says that he falls hard and fast. Will Michelle be the Juliet he has been searching for? Romeo is very interested in clean technology. He wants to go to Burning Man one day and has studied Japanese for three years in college. Ryan Fox is 30 years old, an environmental consultant from San Jose, California. Ryan is compassionate, competitive, and motivated. He dreams about bringing the perfect woman home to his family raisin ranch to enjoy the picturesque sunset of Central California. And he is hopeful that Michelle is the one for him. Ryan is a planner who creates lists for all endeavors he pursues, and that includes his love life. He is looking for a woman who checks off all his boxes, intelligent, down-to-earth, big heart, healthy, a girl-next-door type. Michelle may check all of his boxes, but will he check all of hers? Only time will tell. Ryan is obsessed with ice cream trucks. He loves spreadsheets and is enthusiastic about cuddling. Spencer Williams is 25 years old, a financial crimes analyst from Cleveland, Ohio. 
Spencer is an amazing catch. He is athletic, has a great job, and is incredibly smart. According to the most important person in his life, he is also the world's best dad. Spencer's son is the inspiration that makes him want to be a better man every day. And while he hasn't dated much since his birth, he's here now to find a wife and hopefully expand his already wonderful family. For Spencer, physical attraction gets his attention, but personality is what keeps it. He needs a woman with an open mind who will be vulnerable with him and challenge him to be the best version of himself. What matters most to Spencer is what is in someone's heart and when he meets Michelle, he certainly will not be disappointed. Spencer loves to spend time in the hot tub. He hates movies that require a lot of attention and he loves snowball fights. Urena is 28, an academic interventionist from Grand Rapids. Will describes himself as classy, swaggy, and sharp. He is more than ready to make a substantial connection with someone and is also very tired of being the only single one in his group of friends. Will is looking for a thrill-seeking woman who is always up for a spur-of-the-moment adventure. His dream woman is loyal, ambitious, accountable, and ready to pursue him every day to be the best version of himself because he's going to do the same for her. Will says he's a true romantic that will do anything to make his significant other know how loved she is. And now he's ready to make Michelle the happiest she's ever been. Will hates getting money as a gift and is a Leo and is very into horoscopes and wants to climb Mount Everest one day. And that is all the men from Michelle season. What do you think about the men? Do you have any favorites? Who are your favorites? Hey, Couch Potato, thank you for watching. Click like and subscribe. See you on the next video. Bye.